Now, when most people have a barbecue, they go for meat, glorious meat. But what about the abundance of incredible seafood you have here in the United Kingdom? And when you're down here by the beautiful seaside here in Brighton, and you want to experience the perfect union of flame, flavor, and the freshest catch, well, that's when you head to the salt room. And to take me through the best of the local fresh catch, executive chef Dave Mothersill. All right, so we are in the command center, the kitchen here at Salt Room. This is Dave, he is the chef here. All this is local catch? All or? this is local catch. So we've got um, English native lobsters. We've got crab cores from down the road. We've got a lion caught sea bass, which was caught this morning. Literally over the road there, lion caught. So here, the mussels are also local? Yeah. Obviously, you want to make sure that they're closed, because if it's open, the mussel's dead. If they are open, you can give them a tap on the surface. If they close, they're good to eat. If they stay open, discard them. And then sardines? Yes, yeah, so sardines are just caught in the channel. I always used to hate sardines as a little kid because I always used to think of those tins That's with it. oil and yeah. death. But this fish single-handedly changed the way I think about grilling seafood. And you literally can butterfly them open, brush them with olive oil, a little salt, a little pepper, put a rosemary leaf right in them and lay it right down on the grill. They're amazing. They're oh. fantastic fish. And this is indeed a clam. Indeed. It is, this is so amazing. This is a razor clam because of its resemblance to a barber's razor. And amazing, amazing flavor. One tip that I always give people when they're cooking any kind of seafood, especially something as delicate as like a scallop, you have to take, and correct me if I'm wrong, chef, uh, you take the protein off of the heat source before it's cooked Absolutely. to the proper temperature because the residual heat Heats in it. in the pan, just, you know, just carries on cooking it. There we go. Please. This is the stuff dreams are made on. Shakespeare was wrong. This is this is what dreams are made on. So this platter is known as the surfboard or the salt room, and that's basically what they're serving it on. I'm eating a prawn, shell, head, legs, and all, and I have no problem with that. Mm. Well, best laid plans. Oh, it's superb. I, I, I'm going to come back to you. I love you, but we'll, we'll keep in touch. Facebook me. Well, Chef, thank you so much. Thank you. I'm going to look to eat every damn thing on this platter. Trust me. I don't know what I want to do next. I think I'm going to go crawfish. Talk amongst yourselves. I'll be eating a crawfish. It's not going to be a family-friendly thing. I'm eating tail and sucking head, people.